And you know, with snow on the ground, we saw crash after crash today. In fact, I think we saw nearly a dozen just before 1 p.m. And many snowplow crews are working around the clock to clear your streets so that this doesn't happen to you. But as 41 Action News reporter Aaron Rothfield explains, the single digit temperatures could mean trouble. It's towards the end of his shift, but Terry Reynolds is ready treat some more roads to keep you safe. The plan was to uh, get as much salt down on the road as possible and uh, minimize any accumulation at all. Which is why for hours he and his co-workers have been loading up, spraying salt on the roads, moving from one street to the next, hoping to keep ice from forming. It actually was pretty successful, I think. We didn't really have too much to deal with. Got lucky as far as the amount we had show up on us. But with the bitter cold temperatures, this salt doesn't always do the trick. We can put some additives on it that will accelerate uh, melting, but uh, it is very difficult. What we really need, um, hopefully the next day or two, is some sunshine. Until then, they're asking drivers to be aware. And when another round of snow comes, Terry Reynolds will be back. Practice. Practice. It doesn't happen overnight. To treat the roads once again. Tonight, Aero Rothford reporting. Lee Summit will have crews out tending to those roads around 4.30 tomorrow morning. They want drivers to be aware of the hills, the curbs, the bridges, the roads. Underneath large trees are typically the most problematic with those slick spots.